Can Trump be arrested for buying silence from a former porn star? Trump would have given $130,000 to then-porn actress Stormy Daniels on the eve of the 2016 elections, so that she would not reveal alleged affair. Hello, I want you to be welcome to our channel. In today's video, you'll find out about another scandal with the former President of the United States of America. Don't leave, enjoy, and leave that like. Subscribe to our channel and don't forget to share, this is very important for our channel. Let's get to what matters. Let's go to the news. Donald Trump could face charges and arrest in New York later this week for allegedly making secret payments to a porn star during his 2016 presidential campaign. She revealed an alleged extramarital affair. In a post on his social networks on Saturday, the 18th, Trump said that he expected to be arrested on Tuesday, the 21st, and asked his supporters to protest this alleged detention. However, a spokesman for the former U.S. president stated that he was not notified of any outstanding warrants. Manhattan District Attorney Alvin Bragg has presented evidence to a New York grand jury about a $130,000 payment made to porn star Stormy Daniels in the closing days of the 2016 presidential campaign. In exchange for his silence about an alleged affair. The payment itself would not be illegal, but in practice the money was justified as legal fees for one of Trump's lawyers, Michael Cohen. It is this attempt to conceal the nature of the payment that may be considered criminal, prosecutors claim it was a falsification of business registration. In addition, indirect payment would also be an attempt to hide a relationship from voters, prosecutors claim. Trump has denied the affair and his lawyer has accused Daniels, whose real name is Stephanie Clifford, of racketeering. If he is charged, he would be the first former U.S. president to face criminal prosecution. His plans to run for office again in 2024 make the legal calculation of the imbroglio even more difficult. Criminal cases in New York often take more than a year to go from indictment to trial, and Trump's case is far from typical. That raises the possibility that Trump may have to stand trial midway through the 2024 presidential campaign, or even after Election Day. If he wins, there is no precedent for trying a president-elect on statewide charges. But it is known that, if elected, Trump would not have the power to absolve himself of state office. In addition to the case involving the former porn actress, Trump is investigated for electoral interference in the state of Georgia and undergoes two inquiries, at the federal level, about his role in the attack on the capital of the United States by his supporters, on January 6, 2021, who tried to undo his 2020 election defeat. Finally, there is also an investigation into the top-secret documents he took from the White House to his official residence after leaving office. So what do you think of the latest news? If you really enjoyed staying on top of the main issues in the USA and the world, it doesn't hurt to share it with your two best friends, don't you agree? I already want to thank you because I know I can count on you. A big hug and stay with God, take care.